My name is Shadia Kikonjo. I'm 24 years old, and my discipline is performance. The table is prepared for you. Wishing you Godspeed, glory. There will be mountains you won't move. But you'll have this place to call home always. Yeah. Oh, you'll always have this place to call home always, always, always. This love will keep us through binding of the eyes, silence of the ears, darkness of the mind. This love will keep us through blinding of the eyes, silence of the ears, darkness of the mind. This love will keep us through blinding of the eyes, silence of the ears, darkness of the mind. This love will keep us through blinding of the eyes, Silence of the ears, darkness of the mind. Who am I as an artist? I'm an artist that loves to challenge themselves. Um, for the longest time, uh, I've always felt very limited as an artist uh, because of uh, just how I physically look, like my shape and um, like gender identity and, um, you know, moving to Montreal and getting out of school and exploring and talking to other artists and participating in different projects. I realized that I'm an artist that wants to use their body to challenge themselves and also like cross my own boundaries. Um, I really enjoy putting myself in situations where I'm just like not comfortable in so I can challenge myself. And um, I realized and understood that I'm a, an artist that really will use everything about themselves. And I'll use my mind, my body, my heart in a character and in a story. Um, yeah, I sort of think my myself as a vessel when I go into projects and letting the character and the story take hold um, yeah, I think that's who I am as an artist. Where do I see myself in five years? I would like to say I would see myself in five years in New York City, on Broadway, on the stage, you know, doing my thing. Um, <laughs> I really would really, really, I do see myself like that in five years. But um, I do see myself, uh, I want to create my own theater company, my own black theater company back home in Ottawa. Uh, growing up, I wasn't really, sh I, theater was never really something that I knew about. It was really seen as like a white person thing. Um, uh, and once involving myself into theater in high school and seeing the amount of joy and the amount of growth you get just being in the theater and environment and working on projects uh, really helped and shaped myself who I am as a person. But one of the things that I, that was lacking was 
being able to see people that look like me do their thing, either like at my age or people, folks that were older. Um, and there's a lot of young black people in Ottawa who love musical theater, who love just theater period. And I want to be able to help and provide what AMP, the program has done for me. I wanna hopefully in five years do that for young uh, black artists that live in Ottawa back home. So yeah, what I've learned about myself through AMP. That chaos is good. <laughs> that chaos is very good, but it's depending on where it comes from. I've always considered myself as a very chaotic and energetic person and I never really, I've never really felt grounded with that energy and being an AMP and working with my mentor and just being around the folks that I'm with, it's really shown me how to stay grounded, how the energy that I have isn't negative. It's quite beautiful. It's just where it's coming from and how do I present that where it doesn't exhaust me and it doesn't exhaust the people around me. And confidence, like very, confidence is something that I work on every day and I did not realize that I was lacking so much before coming into this program. And this program has really, really shown me that this kind of art form isn't, it's bigger than myself and it's not about me and kind of having to remove ego and unlearning things that I was taught and things that I've told myself about myself, told myself about myself. Yeah, told myself about myself. Um, just unlearning those things and to really embrace, embrace the fact that this is what I'm doing. Embrace the fact that I'm in this program. Embrace the fact that I'm with people that look like me or people that can empathize with my experience that I click with immediately. Um, AMP has provided me a, a sense of community as well. I've never ever felt so seen, loved, supported and th the amount of directness that <laughs> this program has provided me is what I needed and I'm really excited to go into the real world and to make this AMP program really proud. <laughs>